What's up, guys? Freddy Spice 62 doing a quick, uh, it's a quick video of my Voltron. It's not even a comic book, uh, video, so just want to show off a couple of my toys. I know I had a couple guys ask me if I, how many I had or whatever, so I believe I'm at 115, uh, different robots, so. So this is a, the 24 inch one. I had a couple of these. And this is the newer ones that came out by Transmaster. And um, these are the ones I pulled out of my storage today. These are uh, these are some of the newer ones. They're more poseable and look a little bit different. Colors are a little bit more like metallic looking on that one. That's the uh, 25th anniversary one. This is a regular one where it's uh, more flat like. I don't know if you can tell the green of the lines. One is more metallic looking than the other one. Um, these are my other ones. These are uh, they're the bootleg version of the regular one, which are like the little bit more hard to find type. Um, so you can see the the belts are different. This one has a diamond belt, and uh, their faces are a little bit more narrow. It's a bunch of little things that just uh, make them different from the other ones. This is uh, another one. This is the, the V belt. And um, I know t they look the same to anybody else, but you can tell a difference on like, uh, I don't know if you see the green lines. This one this one has the green, the yellow uh, ring, where that one has a metallic one and just constructed different. This one over here, this is the, this is the upside down star with the, it has a black face. And, uh, you compare them you can see where uh, this one's more made out of plastic the body's plastic it's not metal like the other ones um, you can see the little yellow uh, ribbits they used on that and these don't have that and yeah those are a couple these are the ones I have a display in my room those are another uh, set of the 24 inch ones and this is a set of all five, and I do have the sixth one, which is, uh, I don't know if anybody watches the cartoon, the original one. There was uh, the original Blue Lion driver, his name was uh, Seth, and um, he gets injured, so he was uh, replaced by the princess, and this one's pretty cool. I'll give you this story. This is a watch right here. That's actually my watch from when I was a kid. You got another diamond belt one in the back, still in the box. And you got the arms in the back. They're all different, you guys. Like little little things make them different. Um, this is one of the the original Matchbox ones. Uh, Matchbox made this over here in the United States and has a little green dot like right above the nose. This is another black faced uh, Voltron, it has an upside down star. This is, uh, was sold individually in the box. This one's pretty cool. Uh, I've never seen one of these on eBay. This is the same one as the first one I showed in the box, but this is uh, it's from uh, Japan. It, uh, this uh, you won't find it around here, so uh, it's really hard to find one. If you guys like Legos, this was a this is a line that they made of the Voltron action figures, but they're like little Lego size ones. Here's another. Uh, this was a uh, kind of like the Shogun Warriors. If anybody remembers those, they had these big, uh, like it looks like those soap bottle, like shampoo bottle, uh, kind of plastic. That's what they make these toys out of. And then here I have the set of the plastic ones. Mm -hmm. 
I'm gonna open one of those up so you guys can check them out. There's these right here, which is, um, I have two of them right there, and then I have the one in the big box in the back. So just uh, so you guys can see what they look like, all different ones. Now the set of five. These are the ones that uh, Twinami made, where uh, those those don't come apart. These are uh, these are another set of like the ones I have over there. You got the V belt one, and that's a normal one. This is a black face with the the proper star. It's not upside down like the other ones. And this is just a regular. Uh, this is just the Lion Bot, which is a uh, the knockoff that came from. Uh, I believe it's from China or Japan. One of those two. These are my these are my pimp shoes. Put these on when I want to run real fast. Actually, I've worn these twice. Uh, only special occasions. I wore one. I think one of the times was to my uh, my brother's wedding, and the other time, I believe it was for like a. It was a birthday party or something, but. They maybe run faster when I put them on. So these are the Matchbox uh, Boltron box. Let me open one up. Let's scope out what they look like. This is all the five lines in the box, and gives you the little story here on the side. This was a um, this is a box they made after I, I believe this was the first one they put out and then uh, they put out this one right here. This is right here. This is a Japanese one. It's uh, it looks just like the American ones. Just uh, Japan. They they have all the cool stuff over there. But everything is a kind of reading on this shit, but comes with his little pamphlet or something. I think read backwards in Japan or whatever. But that's that. More stuff, and there's this. The only difference on these from the American one, on uh, the ones that came from Japan, everything shoots like the little arms you shoot out. Where uh, the American ones they don't because uh, its kids were getting injured, and that's pretty cool. This is a this is a hard one to find. It took me a while to get that one. I really like the box. The box is fucking cool. Shows you Voltron like kind of like X-ray vision, so you can see how it works. And this is Korean Voltron. Um, this looks different from the other ones. And uh, these in the back too, they're the Korean ones. That's a... Uh, like a Mighty Mug. I guess like a little Mighty Mug, but it's like super small. There's some more Korean Voltrons. I'll just show you... Uh, this one's still wrapped up in the plastic, so I'll hold on. You can see there's gold and it's got the red ears instead of the yellow ears. It's still wrapped up or else I would have taken them out. The other one's wrapped up too, you guys. So this is a Korean Korean Voltron. Here's some of my smaller figures. Which uh this one's really hard to find. Actually shoots out the arms and everything. This is like a half scale of the, the normal one. And the box in the back. And then these I already showed. That's the big Shogun Warrior one. It's still wrapped up, never took it out. This is a remote control one. And 
that's it, you guys. So, let's see, I got a shot of everything in here. Oh, for to talk about the top ones. These are the Mattel ones that they made. They made these uh, 2013 or 14, I believe. It's the whole set. These form a big uh, 24 inch Voltron, too. That's all the lines, and that's more boxes in the back. Um, that's everything guys hope you enjoyed it uh, hope I didn't talk too much it's just a little uh, Voltron phase I went through so alright you guys hope you enjoyed it have a good one